Fire crews working hard to increase containment lines on the Bobcat fire to protect foothill communities down below. So far, that blaze has scorched nearly 30,000 acres in the Angeles National Forest. It's only 6% contained tonight. That fire, along with several others, still burning out of control tonight. But the larger worry for many is our plummeting air quality. Thick smoke still choking the region at unhealthy levels, and it might get worse. Here's Eyewitness News reporter Annabelle Munoz. Well, it still looks and smells very smoky here in Pasadena, and that smoke advisory has been extended until Sunday afternoon. We did talk with some people who decided to venture outdoors, and we spoke with a doctor who explains why you should try to stay indoors, but there are some tips if you go out. The hazy sky across Southern California still looks anything but normal. It's so smoky, there's the mountain right there and you cannot even see it. It looks scary, honestly. Like every time I like look out the window, it's like this like yellow color. Some people are trying to carry on with normal tasks and responsibilities. I'm used to it. The air I don't like, but you have to take risks. Vicki Bernard worked at the Sierra Madre Farmers Market today. We have to sell, so here we are. The unhealthy air quality also triggered the closure of a handful of COVID-19 testing sites in LA County over the weekend. Dr. Ali Jamador says going out is especially harmful for people with asthma or COPD, although not exclusively. With the air quality that it is right now, I don't have asthma or COPD, but walking from just from the uh, from my front yard to the house, uh, the smoke caused some shortness of breath. So this smoke and the negative aspects of it actually get into your blood system. Just the same as if someone's smoking a cigarette. Still, many are choosing to shop or grab a bite outdoors. So what can you do if you are outside and you're concerned about COVID-19 and poor air quality? I would say that the, the, the like a damp cloth will do the same job as it does for COVID. Uh, and on top of it, will provide some additional reduction of smoke uh, that's coming through the to the mask. Um, that's not necessarily proven. Uh, however, uh, uh, damp cloth certainly does decrease the particulate. And exercising is not a good idea for now. Decreasing activity, if you have to be outside, would be the number uh, number one thing. Annabelle Munoz, ABC7 Eyewitness News.